It's a mural that runs deep in symbolism with a message supporting inclusion at a time when communities and cities need it most. Our goal with creating this, this program was really to be an antidote to the hate and harassment that we see in our day-to-day -day lives. Um, we wanted to spread a message around inclusive safety, this idea that no matter what you look like, where you're from, and how you identify, you deserve to feel safe. And it, it's on us, it's on all of us to create that sense of inclusive safety and this is a beautiful way to visualize that. Sherry Hakimi is executive director of Gin Equality, the organization that created the safety mural series coming to all five boroughs in the Bronx. It's here at the International Community School at 345 Brook Avenue in the Mott Haven section. That's where the unveiling took place, highlighting the work of Bronx muralist Lola Love Notes. When I was presented with this project, I felt an immediate connection because like, this is exactly what I do with my art and with my teaching on a daily basis. So I definitely wanted to create, use that message, but also my, my, a lot of my themes are surrounding scenery. And she wasn't alone. A group of students, including 11th grader from the school, Liz Beth, pointed out her contribution to the mural. I enjoyed it. Over the last week and a half, these students have come together and they physically painted it. They started designing it back in March. We did some trainings and some workshops around inclusion and safety and how to end hate and harassment in our communities. Um, and then they created this design. With the initial purpose of the design to coincide with April as Sex Assault Awareness Month, Gen Equality expanded the focus while empowering local communities like this one, which is predominantly Latin. I have a Puerto Rican background, so I, I try to include this very like tropical um, imagery that I, fe I feel makes me feel like I'm home, you know. And so when I was working with the students here and the design process, they are also from, many of them are from Caribbean countries um, and just from, you know, it's international. So when we were discussing like what we wanted to see theme in the, in the mural to make us feel loved and feel safe, they were sending pictures of their home, like of where they're from. For more information on the project and for locations of the murals, go to ginequality.org. For BronxNet, this is Arlene Makoko.